credentials to mm -hmm. be opening up any kind of business here and are working with you guys very closely. Okay? Hey y'all, my name is Ashley Santa Barbie. I live at 3 Jenkins Drive, Indian Head, and I have been a member of this community since I was born 40 years ago. I uh, grew up on Laurel Drive. I live in Indian Head proper now. And this side of the county has just been left to rot. Yeah. I know it. Um, it was great, man. Growing up here, it was pretty awesome. Everything was just kind of cool. And then they started closing down, and then nobody cared. And uh, now it seems the county wants to just do some sort of economic development over here, but not in any kind of way. Just economic development for economic development's sake. Like it's just whatever. <laughs> and uh, I, I ain't here for it. That's not what I'm about. We're a community. We've always been a community. We will always be a community. Um, we don't have a grocery store. And that's something I'm in a, a group, the Indian Head Food Co-op. Um, we're trying to organize a community space with food for this community. This is, this is where we live. My kids live here. I ain't leaving. My parents are going to die here. They've lived here since, since I was born. Um, I see a lot of friends here that I know my whole life. And uh, I'm just tired. We're not. We're not going to go away, y'all. You know, it's up to us, really, because they're not going to do it. <laughs> so we're not going to do it ourselves. Maybe they'll they'll fly on the coattails, but you know, it's us, y'all. It's just us. So we got to do it. Let's do it. I'll be brief. My name is Tanya Ford. I live at 6850 Court and Brian Road. Um, sorry if any of you received several text messages and emails from me, but I'm just floored by the way that we organized in 48 hours, I believe it was. So if we can organize like this in 48 hours, think what we could do if we had time. We can change this, and we shouldn't allow this. Now, to piggyback off of what the other Tanya um, said about us being able to rest easy tonight, that this will not happen, even if the appeal happens. Um, there's church, there are churches, liquor stores, vapor shops, schools, all of that is within walking distance of this facility. So how can it happen even if they appeal? I'm just concerned and I'm watchful as well and trust and believe if you're on my email or in my text messages, uh, you will be getting notifications from me if I see it on Charles County website. And thank you for the delegates who responded to my email and the commissioners who, D.T. <coughs> Wilson is over there. Thank you all. Um, we can't let this happen. We have to protect our children. Yes. Good evening. My name is Tanisha Lattimore. Um, I'm at 6801 before the court. I um, moved here last year. So to see you guys rally like this, different for me because I came from the hooded part of South Beach. <laughs> and like I said, to see this, I'm overwhelmed, first of all. I thank you guys for the ones that responded to my email. Um, I did work for the establishment that is trying to come here 
years and years ago. Trust me, it's not a good establishment. It's definitely not. I've been on the back end of the next door. I've been getting a lot of different emails to my inbox, getting cussed out, all because I want to do what's right. I have three kids. I'm a single mother of three girls. And to have a 15-year-old come to you and say, Mommy, a strip club coming down here in your area? In our area? Why? And I have no answer for that. So that would be my question for you guys. Even though everything has been revoked, of course, I'm 36, so I follow social media a lot. They are still planning to open on Saturday. They're like, don't believe the hype. Forget whatever you guys are saying. They're still going to open. So how can y'all make I think you stated that prostitution, drugs, all of this can come in with this establishment. This is what we're looking into. If they were kicked out of PG County, how can Charles County allow it? Hello, my name is Bob Sonheimer. Uh, I live in 2343 uh, Woodbury Drive in Strawberry Hills and the president of our civic association and we had a meeting about this very issue a quick meeting since it was so short notice but we are uh, even though we couldn't get everybody together we got a lot of people and we are definitely against this type of establishment uh, we, we think that we like people have said we definitely need economic and cultural development on this side of county so yeah. it's stated but we can do a little better than this i think so hopefully we will do that and thank you for having this meeting hopefully uh, we can throw this thing out